Today we'll show you how to promote max bounty CP offers using Bing ads. In this video, we won't be using any type of landing page or custom domain. It means we are using direct linking method. So we'll tell you everything in a complete detail. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing it. So without any further ado, let's get started. So before we start, let me just log in into my Max Bounty account. So I've logged into my Max Bounty account the same way you have to also log in. So after you log in, the next step is that you have to choose the offer which you want to promote using Bing Ads. If you want to know how to choose a CP offer, what are the things that you need to notice in a CP offer so you can uh, consider it for promotion using Bing Ads. So I've already made a video on this topic in which I have explained everything step by step. If you haven't watched that video, you can click the I button or the link in description to watch that video. So once you have done all this, you have logged into your Max Bounty account. The next step is that you have to click on this left hand side search button and then you have to choose the traffic type that you are going to use to promote your CPA offer. So like we are going to use Bing ad to promote our CPA offer. So Bing ads comes under search traffic. So in that case, let's just select search traffic and unselect everything else in the type uh, traffic type. And now you have to choose a geography means you from which country from which geo you want the CP offers from. So we want offers from United States. So let's choose that. And now you have to choose the category from which category or niche you want the offers. We want the offers from survey category. And in the filters, you have to click on approve to run means it will show only offers to us that are already approved to us so that we can just copy the affiliate link and start promoting it. We don't have to request the approval for the offer. And now you have to click on apply search options. So now you can see here comes a list of various types of survey offers that are allowed in US country. Now what you have to do, you have to just click on this EPC button. It will sort all the offers according to the EPC from high to low. You can see here is the offers life point US desktop. So let's choose the offer that we will use for the promotion. Like you can see here is the offer time box reward site. It's allowed in US, Canada, UK, Australia. EPC is 24 cents and the payout for this offer is $24. So the payout is also good and the EPC is also good. It's less than 30 cents, but let's see what's the offer uh, gives. So the offer name is time box reward site. US, UK, Canada, Australia countries allowed for this offer. The conversion requirement is Sign up to Timebox, earn at least $5 and verify your ID within 30 days of signing up to convert. User will uh, will start with a $1 sign up bonus, so they only have to earn $4. So it means when the user will earn $5 in total and will verify their ID within 30 days of the signing up, then only we will get $24 commission. You can see he has also written user earns $5 and verifies ID. And the thing is that user only has to earn $4 uh, user will get $1 bonus when they sign up and the traffic type is a search is allowed and you can see here search traffic is allowed so we can use Bing ads and the daily cap on this offer is 100 actions per day it means we can send up to 100 leads per day and the device allowed is all device operating systems are allowed it means it's the best part of the offer because we can send traffic from desktop mobile and tablet also so let's just promote this offer so to promote this offer we have to generate the affiliate link so what you have to do you have to click on build tracking link button and now you have to choose the traffic that you will be sending like we will sending search traffic because we are using bing ads so let's choose search and in the selector creative let's just choose search and then here comes the our uh, affiliate link you just have to copy it and once you copied your affiliate link the next step is that you have to create a tracking link for this offer in your tracker because if you do the tracking for the offer then only you will get to know what are the keywords what is the device what is the ip address what is the time that is getting us the conversion and based on that we will optimize our campaign and increase the profitability of the campaign so to create the tracking link let me just log in into my qliker account so i logged into my qliker account the same way you have to also log in so after you log in you have to create your tracking link if you want to know how to create a tracking link in qliker account for the max bounty cp offer i've already made a video on this topic in which i've explained every thing completely step by step if you haven't watched that video till now you can click the i button or link in description to watch that specific video so let me just quickly create the tracking link for that specific offer so now you can see the tracking link for the offer has been created so let me just click on it and show you the tracking link you can see here the tracking link 
it is a tracking link you have to copy it and once you have copied it the next step is that you have to go to your bing ad account and start creating your campaign so let me just log in into my bing ads account you have to log in into your bing ads account you don't have to log in in bing.com so i've logged into my bing ad account the same way you have to also log in and after you log in the next step is that you have to create a campaign so to create the campaign you just have to click on this blue color button which says create campaign and now it will ask you to choose what's the goal of this campaign it means if you creating campaign in bing ads what do you want this campaign to do for you what do you want bing to do for you so if you want more traffic on your website more uh, visitors on your website your landing page then in that case you have to choose visits to my website option and if you want have a business location or offline business you have a store brick or motor store or any type of store you have to choose visits to my business location if you want more leads more sales on your website then you have to choose conversions in my website option and if you want more uh, phone calls for your business you have to choose this option if you have a app you want more app install then you have to choose app install objective and if you have a shopify store or ecom store you want to upload catalog of the product then in that case you have to choose sell products from your catalog okay a lot of time people have this confusion that we want affiliate sales we want more lead on cp offers then why not we choose conversions in my website ob objective because it says you that if you choose this objective you will get conversion so we want conversion then why not choose this objective because you can choose only this objective if you have at least 20 to 30 amount of conversions or sales already then only you can upload that data in bing and it will show your ad to those people who match that data like bing will know that these are the people that you are looking to show your ads to then only you will get a better conversion rate but if you don't have any data then if you use this objective you will end up spending more money so like we are uh, creating a new campaign we don't have any existing amount of data so let's choose visits to my website objective after that you have to give a name for your campaign so let's give the name time bucks and now you have to give the campaign budget so let's give the budget of uh, 2000 ina per day and now you have to choose the location like where you want your ads to appear like in our offer uh, us canada australia countries allowed so we can choose us also let so you have to click on let me choose specific location and let's write here united states now you have to click on target and then you have to come here and you see who should see your ad and by default both the options are selected so what you have to do you have to unselect the second one and you have to make sure only first one is selected because we don't want if anyone from india pakistan bangladesh if they uh, put a uh, country like a uh, united states in uh, bing ads and they search something and they uh, see our ad because if they see our ad they will click on it and we will uh, end up spending the money so we don't want people from india pakistan or any other country to click on our ad so in that case you have to unselect this particular option then you have to select language and make sure english is selected because our landing page of the offer is also in english so make sure english is selected and then you have to click on save and go to the next step and now it asks us to add our website url so we don't have any website or any type of landing page so you have to just click on my website is not ready and now you have to give a name for your ad group so let's give the name bulk and now to find the keywords what you have to do you have to look at your offer and you have to see like what your offer is all about like we have this offer it's a paid survey offer because people can uh, fill the surveys and they can earn money through it so let's just write here paid survey keyword and let's search it and now you can see here comes a list of various survey keywords that you can add in your ad group so i want to tell you one thing that you have to at least add 700 to 800 keywords in your ad group a lot of time i have seen people adding like 5 or 10 keywords but you don't have to add so less amount of keywords you have to at least add 700 to 800 keywords the more you add the better it will be so what you have to do to add the keywords you have to click on this plus 78 keywords and you have to just select all of them and you have to go here in bulk and click on add so once you have added all the keywords you have added at least 700 to 800 keywords in your ad group the next step is that you have to check them manually that is there any type of keyword that is not related to your offer like sometimes there are keyword that are not buyer keywords like there are those are the informational type of keyword uh, let me show you an example like uh, here you can see it says yahoo survey 
our offer is a paid survey it's not a yahoo survey so you have to just delete this keyword so you have to add the keywords and then you have to manually review them and if you see any type of keyword that is not particularly related to your offer you just have to delete that keyword and after doing all that you have to come here and you have to click on save and go to the next step button and after that you have to create an ad for your campaign so to create an ad you have just have to click on create ad button and in the ad type you just have to click here and you have to select expanded text ad and now you have to give a final url for your offer so a lot of time people will be thinking that we don't have created a landing page we don't have any website we don't have any custom domain so what we have to finally enter in this url so that we don't have to create a landing page and we directly link our offer through bing ad so to do that you just have to come here and you will see here us default written landing page you just have to click on this preview button and it will open the landing page url for the offer so you can see the landing page has been opened so what you have to do now you just have to copy this till dot com you just have to copy this you have to come here and you have to paste it that's it that's the thing that you have to do so i will tell you later in the video like why we have added this particular url and how max monty will know that we uh, that sales and leads are coming through our affiliate link will tell you everything later it will clear everything and now you have to add the title part for your campaign so a lot of time people get confused here that what should they write in title part one two and three and in the description so that they get the maximum ctr and the conversion rate through their ads so you don't have to panic you just have to come here and you have to go to bing.com and now you have to click on the top right corner where it shows three lines you have to click here and in the drop down menu you have to click on settings and then you have to choose country and region and now you have to choose in which country you are running your ads so we are running our ads in united states english you have to choose this and now you have to add a keyword that's related to your offer so our offer is survey so let's write here paid survey and search it and now if you scroll down you will see here a couple of ads this written ad you can see here so it's a ad you what you have to do now you just have to copy this and you have to paste here i'm not saying that you have to just copy everything from this ad and you have to create a duplicate version of this ad you don't have to do that you just have to take like some things and you have to edit them and then you can create your new ad like here's written earn money online earn up to 50 dollar per day okay you have to add your thing also and you just have to take the suggestions from this and now you have to add here the title part 3 here we can add 2021 and now you have to add add text 1 so let's take suggestions from here so let's just copy this and paste it here and that text 2 we can write more than 5 million people have already join us okay so you can see here's the ad copy that we have written best ways to make money online earn up to dollar 50 per day earn without investment more than 5 million people have already joined us so we have created our ad copy and now comes the most important part of your campaign that is creating a tracking link and adding the affiliate link so to do that what you have to do you just have to click on add url option and you see here the option written tracking template so what you have to do you just have to come in your qlikr account you just have to create uh, uh, copy the tracking link that we have already created you just have to copy it you have to come here and you have to paste it and at the end you have to add slash curly brace open keyword curly brace close curly brace open again then add id and then curly brace close so now let me explain you what exactly this tracking link will do so when someone will click on our ad this tracking link here will be executed and using qliker it will be redirected on our primary url here which is the affiliate link that we have copied from the max monty so ultimately our affiliate link will be clicked and max monty will know that we have sent the uh, click and we have sent the lead so we will get the 
commission no one else will get the commission only we will get the commission for uh, for the offer and for the lead and the final url here is just for the show purpose that bing knows that the landing page url and the url that we have entered here in final url is the same so that it doesn't disapprove our ad this url will don't do anything in your ad it just for the sake to write here and now you have to click on the save button here so now you can see our ad copy is finally created one thing i want to tell you that if you are getting a campaign in bing ad make sure you add at least two to four ad copies in your campaign because then only you will know that which one is performing the best and which is performing the worst so it's better to create more ad copies when you create a campaign at least add two to four ad copies but we are just creating one for the sake of this video and now you have to click on save and go to the next step button and now you can see here's the per day budget that we have set for our campaign is 2000 ayana per day and now you have to choose the bid strategy uh, you have to choose enhanced cpg if you want to choose manual cpg then you have to contact the sub bing ad support and you can ask them to add the manual bidding option you can choose that and now you have to give, uh, give the bid for your campaign so let's just give the bid of 40 ayana per day and now you have to click on campaign targets and you have to check the country that you have selected make sure all devices are allowed and now you have to click on advanced campaign settings you can choose the schedule if you want to uh, run ads on a particular date or time you have to come here and you will see here option of ad distribution you have to click here and then you have to choose the second one which show, uh, says Bing AOL Yahoo search owned and operated only because we want our ads to show only in Bing.com we don't want to show our ads on Bing partner website because the traffic that we will getting from Bing partner website is not that good so we don't want our ads to show there so you have to choose owned and operated only and now you have to click on the save button so now you can see our campaign is finally created and our ads are eligible and they are approved by Bing. It means they will now start to run. A lot of time people have this confusion that if you use direct linking method through Bing ads, we are not using our custom landing page and then in that case Bing will disapprove our ad and they will not run. It's not the case if you follow everything correctly, you follow all the steps that are shown in this video, your ad will definitely get approved and they will start to run. So I hope you like this video. If you did then don't forget to hit the like button. If you have any doubt, you can ask them in the comments below.